Thank you for enrolling in the 2016 IVAS certification course. As trained veterinarians, you all bring with you experience in best practice of modern veterinary medicine and surgery. As scientists, you understand research, bias and evidence. As compassionate members of a community, you seek new cost-effective treatments to enhance the welfare and reduce suffering of your patients and clients. I am Susan Peden and I am honoured to share your journey as tutor, demonstrator and lecturer towards integrating Chinese medicine and acupuncture into your treatment protocols. From my earliest memories, I have been fascinated by animals and nature. Once I graduated as a veterinarian, I became fascinated by human life and its relationship with animals. Once I understood and undertook the IVAS training in 1994, I remember the fresh understanding of these relationships. Suddenly, I had a new lens for viewing the motivation for clients confiding realms of material. She always wakes me at 2 a.m. when she's scratching. He always hides when my son comes after dinner. That lump under the jaw, it goes up and it comes down when it rains. Once you understand the study of the five elements and the concept of energy transfer across the five element cycle, these snippets become vital clues. Once you have identified the patient's constitution, you can, with mindful awareness, influence the flow of energy and allow harmony and balance to resurface. Some graduates of the IVAS training have taken five element theory, readjusted their thinking and developed a simple and successful practice based on intuitive diagnosis and the insertion of only one or two needles with good results. For 2000 years, masters have practiced veterinary acupuncture. There are masters in veterinary acupuncture practicing now. My hope for you is not to follow in the footsteps of the masters, but that you will all seek what the masters sought. Please enjoy this five elements lecture with an open mind. Unwrap your five element lens. Welcome information about life stresses and tensions in relationships. Understand that illness represents an invitation to change. Understand that the interpersonal exchange that clients seek is an opportunity for re-education. You will hold the key to help rid them of their animal symptoms, to improve their general health and prevent the return of difficulties. We have started this journey together in fire or action. We are moving into earth or manifestation. Next will be metal for communication, water for reflection, then wood for conception of ideas and the passing of your exam. The maturity of this cycle gives form to fire, action, and then the manifestation of your case reports, earth, and then your attainment of the international certification in veterinary acupuncture. The good news is that the cycles continue. As you journey through the adventure of integrative veterinary medicine, action, manifestation, communication, reflection and conception. As a director of the Australian College of Veterinary Acupuncture, I hope to support you over many years and perhaps decades of veterinary life. Thank you.